One day after the heartbreaking and horrific crash into Hawaii Nails Lawn in Deer Park, family members of some of the victims gathered to mourn, grappling with an unimaginable tragedy. They're wonderful people, all of them. They were all wonderful people, especially Ken and his wife. They treated you like family. Longtime customers grieving alongside the family of at least one of the four people who were killed, identified as the owner of the nail salon, 37-year-old Jian Chai Chen of Bayside, Queens. Customers say he went by Ken. We're told his wife is one of the nine injured. She just had surgery, so uh, she's she's supposed to be okay. Um, Kenny was a gentleman, uh, always accommodated people. A 12-year-old girl is also among those who were injured. Police say 64-year-old Stephen Schwally was speeding in a minivan before crossing over Grand Boulevard and crashing into the salon on Friday afternoon around 4.30. Customers say they've been told two of the people who were killed were female employees of the salon. Longtime customer John Vasallo says one of them was his go-to nail tech. A great uh, nail tech and very happy-go-lucky person. The whole vibe in the store was always uh, happy. The fourth victim has been identified as 30-year-old off-duty NYPD officer Amelia Renhack. She started on the force in 2018 and had 163 arrests under her belt. She worked out of the 102nd Precinct in Queens alongside her husband, Detective Carl Renhack. The two were married in September 2023. The NYPD said in a tweet, quote, The NYPD mourns the loss of police officer Amelia Renhack. She was tragically killed yesterday while off duty on Long Island. Please keep her family, friends and co-workers in your thoughts. Rest in peace. Meantime, the shock of the deaths reverberating through the Deer Park community. The total destruction of this whole entire situation is not, you can't even wrap your head around it. For many, hearing the driver has been arrested for DWI is horrifying. I just keep thinking that if there was another car there, that that would have stopped.